and my tori me reja da cool yay and my tori me yay and my tori me reja Hi guys, you're welcome to Afrobeat Global TV and yes, it is the Vibe Queen and it is your favorite celebrity show. It is the Celebrity Spotlight Show and you know what we do on the Celebrity Spotlight Show, yeah? We bring in some of your favorite guests. We bring in some of your favorite celebrities to vibe to their top five songs and we also get to know them. So yes, you know that in past editions, we've had people review things they would not usually review. So I am super excited about this particular episode and I am super excited about my guest. Before you meet my guest, you know what I always do now. I have to do it. I have to place you guys on suspense. So let's go on a quick break and when we come back, you're going to meet my guest for this particular episode. Stay tuned, guys. We'll be right back. Hello, I'm a proper doctor and I am the cover star for Uncut Extra Lives. Welcome back, guys. It is still the Celebrity Spotlight Show. And before the break, I mentioned that I'm going to be doing a big review of my celebrity who is on Spotlight today. Guys, she's beautiful. She's energetic. Like, she, she's a vibe queen herself. Like, if you follow her on social media, like, you would just see... There's, there's no way you'll be down and you won't watch her dance and just, you know get the energy back or smile i'm talking about no other than an ex big brother ninja housemates the beautiful Watoni. Yay. come on <laughs> ah, hey sure you guys are feeling very ready are you feeling very ready <laughs> okay Watoni, how are you doing i'm good i mean you look beautiful thank you as always anyway because we see you on your page we see you and then we're like that's more but Tony is really beautiful. Thank you. All right. Um, are you considering fashion? This is not part of my questions though, because you're so fashionable. Like you, I know you also like. It seems I have a store. Yes. Like a store. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, are you considering maybe your own clothing line? To be honest, no. no. Maybe not for now. Okay. All right. Okay. So, welcome to the Celebrity Spotlight Show. Thank you. We'll be vibing to your playlist um, in the second segment. For this segment, we're going to get to know you better and ask a few questions. Yeah. So, my first question is, I mean, it feels like um, there's a relationship between yourself, like your state, your state of origin and um, Kenya. So... Are you from Kenya? Is there any relationship so, with Kenya? <laughs> my mom is Kenyan. Oh, my dad is Nigerian. Wow. But I think the reason why I I, I tilt towards the Kenyan mm-hmm. side a lot is because I was born there and I grew oh, up there. Oh, wow. And I can speak Swahili. Are you serious? Yeah. So when did you come to Nigeria? 13, 14. Wow. So I stayed there for like 13 years. Wow. That's beautiful. Wow. Okay. So um, what's your full name? Apart from Watoni and Yasi, did I pronounce that right? Yeah, so okay. it's, Watoni is my middle name. It's Florence Watoni Anyansi. Okay, so is Watoni a Kenyan name? Yes. What does it mean? <sighs> Long story short. Mean? You don't know <laughs> no, I know, I know. <laughs> but you know, unlike Nigeria, where mm-hmm. you can be named a certain name to mm-hmm. mean kind, God's own, and mm-hmm. all that. But in Kenya, you're named after your grandma. Ooh, so going okay. by the qualities your grandma or your great grandma is or was, okay, so they okay. give the name. So my oh, grandma wow. was kind, oh, wow. soft-hearted. So wow. they felt to give me Watoni. Wow, name. that's really beautiful. Okay, so um, what keeps Watoni going whenever she's down? Music. Hmm. Do you know now that at least I can dance? I'm like, oh, how was it before? Like, <laughs> what kept me going before? Mm-hmm. I think before I would say my son, but of course I don't see him 24 7. Really? Is he so, in Nigeria too? Yes, yes, he mm-hmm. is. Okay. So it's music, my friends, family. Okay, beautiful. Um, so who is your celebrity crush? Hmm. Ah, for, you know, from the house I used to say, <laughs> Toke Makinwa, because there's just something about her. Mm. I would say it's okay. Okay. Um, my crush is the fact that she keeps him. As I said, she like. I feel like there are times it's so difficult, but yes. she like keeps. She, she keeps, keeps going. going. Yes, yeah, she keeps yes, going. Yes. After my book, I 
I saw that there, it's like I'm going towards her direction. Mm-hmm. She, I realized she released the book. Yes, I have a did. book. Yes. She has a show, mm-hmm. like the talking moments mm-hmm. thing. So yeah, she, you'll be talking. Okay, so male, with your male celebrity crush? Uh, that's hard. What can I think of? It doesn't have to be Nigerian. It doesn't have to be. I'll go with Osha. Okay, Osha mm-hmm. Raymond. Mm-hmm. But that dude does not seem to be getting older. I don't understand because he was in um, Ghana recently and we saw clips from his performances at um, the Global Citizen Festival in yeah. Ghana. And he, he can still dance yes. with his body and I'm like, ah, even the voice control. The... <laughs> and then there's been this trending news about himself having a striking resemblance with um, Peter. Is it Peter or Paul from Peace Square? Yeah. Have you noticed that? Yes, yes. Okay, so um, if you could make use of a magic wand now mm-hmm. um, to make a wish, what would it be? I would wish to be very successful. <laughs> okay, okay. And you shall be very successful. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, since you stepped out of the Big Ninja house, um, what moment would you refer to as your happiest moment? So uh, the first day I saw my son after the house, Aww. my book lunch, starting my talk show, and the fact that I won a friend or one or two friends after the house. Okay, cool. Um, so we've heard a lot of people say um, after the show, we've heard a lot of housemates say that you know um they they even almost went into depression probably because of society's expectation of a reality star and you know how things were going or trolls from people or different things was that was that was there ever a moment where you you were almost pushed into depression and what caused it and if yes what caused it and how did you deal with it um, to be honest, there was no time because okay. I feel like if I, I didn't let it happen because mm-hmm. I would I felt like I would be letting myself down yeah. to start with. So no, mm-hmm. there was no time. It was it, yes, I agree. It was challenging, mm-hmm. but no, there was no time. Okay, we're glad. We're so so glad. Watson is a strong woman, guys. Yes. <laughs> okay, so what's your favorite meal? Chips and fish. Me? I love seafood okay, in general. Cool. Yes. Um, so I'm going to be asking you, um, I'm going to be playing on some, you know, similar words, okay. similar um, things, and you're going to be telling me which you prefer. So music or movies? Music. Okay. Dance or sing? Dance. <laughs> Chicken or turkey? Turkey. Okay. Um, heels or sneakers? Heels. <laughs> any day, any time? Yes. Trousers or, trousers or skirts? Trousers. Okay, cool. Um, if you could be any other celebrity apart from yourself for a day, who would you be and why? I would say Osha. Osha, yes. why? <laughs> his songs, his dance, his vibes. Really? Yeah. So if you and then, be... of course, you'd want to look pink. Pink, like Osha. When he's still mm. that old. So if you so, get yeah. that power, that one day, you're going to tour everywhere. Like... Dancing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Cool. So, um, my last question. Um, what's your worst date experience so far? I don't think I've had a date <laughs> since after the house, to be honest. Okay, what about before the house? Uh, before the house... First, I had to wait mm-hmm. for the person. Mm-hmm. And then, I think the guy was a talkative. <laughs> <laughs> And there are times I want to. Generally, I also talk, so yeah. I, probably it's me being well, selfish, yeah. but I also want to be heard. Yeah. So now this one, I'm not even being heard at all, and then you're now talking. <laughs> Actually, I feel like most ladies, for them, it's a turn off when you talk too much. Because yeah. too, I don't like the way you talk too much. But I think I can talk, like I can talk, listen. But it's not every time that I want to talk too, really. But yeah, I think it's actually a very big turn off. For so many ladies yeah so i know i said lastly but yeah lastly now and i mean it so um are you single or yes. in a relationship 
single. Okay, guys, shoot your shot. <laughs> What's your spec? Tell them. Let me help you on the show. What's your spec? Please tell people. <laughs> What's my spec? Just be a vibe, to be honest. Shit. We've passed the stage of be tall. Be, honestly. <laughs> honestly, see, you people, if you have, I know there are some people they'll be like, ah, hey, you are telling me I'm not in that category. I can't, I, I can't. See, so she has said, okay, of course, you have to look presentable, but please be a vibe. And that's easy. Be a vibe. Okay, so thank you so much, Atoni. Um, we're about to step into the vibe session. Oh, and right. I trust you because I know you are going to deliver. Okay, guys, so let's go on a quick break. And when we come back, we're going to go straight into Atoni's top five songs at the moment. Stay tuned, guys. Don't go nowhere. We'll be right back. Right. 